Are you playing your game where you think that everything that you do, I've got a successful business doing real work. We are a service economy. We exported inflation. Yeah, this is part of that conversation that I, I have pretty regularly about, you know, which game are you playing, right? Are you playing your game where you think that everything that you do, I've got a successful business doing real work. Let's say that you're a plumber and you know that your job is based on, I am booked out for months. I have more work than I know what to do with. And that's the case until it's not. I'm going to keep working. Well, if people can't afford to pay for your services and it is not mission critical, very soon you're going to find yourself in the same boat with everybody else, right? We're a service economy. One of the things that's really interesting that we've done, you know, since 2000, maybe even before, is that we exported inflation. We had a more or less stronger dollar. And because we had a strong dollar, we would buy goods from somewhere else, China, India, they would do all the hard work, right? They would pay the low wages, right? Does that make sense? We weren't make, we weren't making anything. Yeah. We were building, we were exporting inflation over there and we were importing debt. And so by doing that, we were pretty happy. We're in a precarious place now. The dollar is iffy now. It's not strong. It's coming up across, you know, uh, reach. It's re it's it's starting to become weak. And if we have a weak dollar that collapses, all that inflation comes back here. No one's going to want to use our dollar if our dollar loses value. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you like this content, you can find me on Money in the Bank with Frank on all of your favorite podcast platforms, on Facebook, on LinkedIn, on our YouTube channel. Look forward to bringing you more content like this in the future. Thanks.